destroyed. Hey, what is going on guys? Hello, that's what Spider playing some Call of Duty Black Ops 3. It's finally here, guys. Get freaking excited. Like, we are going to hit this so hard right in the nuts. Like, I'm saying we are going to go hard in the paint right now. So I want to talk to you guys in this video about a few things. One, I want to talk to you about the video, about the game, all that kind of stuff that you're seeing. Kind of let you guys know what's going on in case you don't have the game or you haven't actually seen or played any of it. Um, next, I want to talk to you guys about what the schedule is going to be with Black Ops. Like, what am I actually going to bring you? How often can you expect to see it? That kind of stuff. And then lastly, I kind of just want to touch up on some general information about the channel, blah, 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 blah. So let's dive right into the game mode, all right? This is Safeguard. I believe it's a new game. Um, I don't really know the map. I think it's Evac. Yes, Evac and it's Safeguard. Safeguard, if you haven't seen or heard anything about it yet, it's a new game mode here in Black Ops 3. Basically, it's two rounds or it could be four rounds. But let's just start out with the scenario that it's going to be two rounds. So two rounds, you either start with a robot that you have to escort or you start by having to stop the other team from escorting the robot. So you start on one side of the map and if you have a robot, you have to try to get it over to the other side of the map into that red circle. And if you do, then you win that round. And then you'll switch sides and then you'll be the person who has to defend that red circle or whatever from the robot getting into it. So it's a really cool game mode. Um, as far as objective game modes go, I love objective game modes and this is probably one of my favorite. I'm not even going to lie. This, Search, and Domination are my favorites. But anyway, Safeguard, yes. So right now we are actually trying to get our robot into that circle to try to win this round. And it's going to go right down to the wire. Like this round we literally only win with like one second left on the clock. Like it's that freaking intense. And you may say, Tyler, what the hell? You're not even playing the objective. Like why aren't you escorting the robot, right? Cause you have to stand near it to actually get it to walk forward. Um, well, I am playing the objective kind of. So what I'm doing is, yeah, you know, I'm not there with the robot walking, you know, hand in hand with them. But what I am doing is I'm clearing out the area that we need to get to in order to win the round. So yes, I am playing the objective i'm not just going for kills etc etc but yeah you're right i'm not i'm not walking hand in hand with the robot it's good to actually be around the robot because you get a ton of points being around the uh, robot if you're actually walking with it and escorting it you get like 25 points every couple seconds or second or so anyway but if you get killed while you're around it you get like 125 points per kill rather than 50 so you get a ton of points if you actually sit near the robot um as you can see now we are at not attacking we are defending they're attacking so we're trying to stop their robot we're trying to stop them from getting into our base and it's it's fun it's fun I, I strongly suggest if you guys have black ops 3 play it safeguard like play safeguard I play ground war so it's a mixture of TDM domination safeguard and I love it ground war is my favorite game mode by far um, now let me just touch up if you guys have a PlayStation 4 go ahead and add me I'm the cosmic spider I will probably add just about anybody who adds me um, but I need friends. I, I want people who want to play the objectives, who want to, you know, help better the team rather than better themselves. Um, so hit me up, the Cosmic Spider on play, uh, PlayStation 4. I'll add you. And uh, guys, witnesses, this is amazing. Like this was such a tear I went on right here. Um, but anyway, let's talk about now. What am I going to be bringing with Black Ops 3? Are you always going to have to expect this kind of video, just a regular gameplay video? No. You don't, but yes, I will upload these, okay? Because I, I want to bring you guys games that I thought like, wow, that was intense. And that was, this was that game. This was that game. So this was intense for me. So yes, I brought it to you. It's kind of like a general gameplay commentary type of thing. But um, I'm also planning on bringing back the gold camo series. Um, this gun, the CUDA, I've actually almost gotten the gold camo for it unlocked. Uh, and then also, diamond camo series so that is so freaking exciting like i have done that now for literally like three generations of um call of duty and this one i'm really hoping to hit really hard and stick with it because this game is actually pretty freaking fun like it's not like advanced warfare really this is way more fun so expect gold expect diamond camo gameplays when they come out uh i don't really know yet because i don't have a schedule made up for when that's gonna be but yes expect that um, also expect some strategy videos. I really want to be able to help you guys better your game as well as bettering my own game You know going in trying different strategies failing and succeeding learning what works when one doesn't so expect strategies as far as what game modes expect search and destroy domination and safeguard as of right now um, not team deathmatch because 
you don't really need a strategy for team deathmatch just kind of run around do your own thing you know what i mean so yeah strategy videos on those three game modes as long as well as sorry gold camo diamond camo and then the general gameplay commentaries that we have now expect nazi zombies and expect the campaign walkthrough i'm gonna try to get through the campaign on realistic like that is a goal of mine so we're gonna give that a shot and that's it that's it for this whole commentary i'm basically done i want to talk to you guys a little bit about the game in general and so right now you can see this camo i have on it's pretty cool and it's only 50 headshots so it's a really easy camo to get it's really badass also I am playing as the Seraph Specialist. If you guys don't know anything about the Seraph, you unlock it at level 22. And she's got a really cool ability. So I don't use like the gun abilities and stuff. Like typically I'll use like a, a passive ability or something. And so I used battery for the longest time, but I use like her, her shield thing that she has. I didn't use her weapon, her war machine, whatever. This girl, I am using like her XP boost. I'm not using that revolver. So that's what I'm using. I'm using the Seraph with that XP boost. And that's it. So until next time, guys, please make sure to subscribe if you want to see more Black Ops 3 gameplay. I'm going to try to get you some at least four or five times a week. And that's it. So I love you guys. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. Another win for the Accord, RTB. They got what was coming. The 54 Immortals crush all opposition.